to the weekend, guys. We got a special guest host right here, Spencer Whittenborn from Bash in the Grass. But you know what time it is. It is time for us to let you know what our top event picks are for this upcoming weekend and week. So let's get to it. <laughs> This Friday over on Historic Commercial Street, catch Gin JX Trio over at White River Brewing Company. You can have two hours of sexy, soulful, jazzy originals and covers, uh, 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. This will be on the patio, so I'm pretty sure when, when it rains, they will if they'll cancel. Mm -hmm. But as long as the weather is nice, then you can go and see the well, Tim JX trio. That's awesome, <laughs> unless they bring them in, because sometimes they have they uh, the bands. Do they really? Yeah. I did yeah. not know that. Sometimes they'll bring um, them in to the right, at the uh, right by the bar or in the back. Yeah. Oh, cool! Yeah, they have see, a stage out there. I've never even been there. I didn't know. I just said. I saw in the event it said weather permitting. Oh yeah. Um, so yeah. Just, it might not yeah. be on the patio, but it's going to happen either way. It will be a surprise. Yeah. Let us know. Yeah. Okay, Spence. What is your first pick? Um, Bub's Distillery has an open mic every Wednesday night. It starts at six. Uh, it's a good time out there. Uh, they got moonshine slushies and other beverages. Uh huh. And then. Uh, that's my first pick. Ooh, yeah, I love Bubs. Have you had their pizza yet? I have not had their pizza yet. Oh, I had that brick oven pizza now, and Ooh. it is so tasty. I went out there for my birthday last year, and I was like, oh, so good. And their drinks are so, so good. I like their yeah, slushies. slushies. Yeah, I usually have those at the festivals, because mm -hmm. they're usually... They do their job well. Yes, they do, guys. <laughs> you definitely need to go out there. And it's not too far away from downtown. It's like no. 20 minutes away. No. It's really not that far. Not even all the way to Rogersville. It's like, what is that, 125? Yeah, yeah, something like that. So just go east. East Springfield, get out there. Um, so my first pick, oh, man, guys. Did you, have you ever been to the Route 66 Festival? Not here, not out here. No, but I've heard lots of stories. <laughs> lots Ooh. of stories. Wow, so this is going, uh, man, this is going through th Thursday all the way until Saturday. Wow. And I every day is full of events. So on Thursday, it actually starts at 1. And then they're um, having a band out there. It's like, I think it's a 13-piece band. Oh, wow. Um, called the Emerald City Band. <laughs> um, but they play funk, disco, uh, 80s, Motown, oh, man, it sounds so much fun. Yeah. 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 Um, and then, you know, they have the parade that goes. Where is that uh, exactly? So it's downtown. Okay. Um, so they have, uh, they'll go around the square and, am I right? I can't remember. Yeah, they go around the square and then they go, they have the, the map on their website actually of the different ways they're going to go okay. on Route 66 because this was actually the birthplace of Route 66. Hmm. Yeah, so they'll have vendors and lots of music every day. Let's see, on Friday, it actually starts at 10 a.m. Oh my God, 10 wow. a.m. on a Friday. That's so awesome. if you're not working, wake up, <laughs> go out there. And then you get to see a lot of cool cars. Oh, so Cool, awesome. so they do have a big car show. Oh, yeah, Great. yeah, yeah. I love that. I want to go. Yeah. <laughs> I want to go. Where is the stage set up at? Um, is there more than one? Yeah, there's a couple of them. There's <laughs> one on the square, and then they usually have one off of Jefferson Street. Because they, okay. they uh, closed down uh, most I of the street. I did hear an ad on the radio. Yeah. I think it said McDaniel and Jefferson. Yeah. And I wasn't sure if that's what it was. But. Yep. It's going to be so much fun. So Thursday through Saturday and family friendly, of course. And I do believe you could bring your dog. So uh, what's your second pick? So Sunday the 14th, I'm going to head over to the Outland Ballroom and see this band. I'm pretty sure they're from California. They're called the Surfer Jets. Uh, so if you like like surfer rock music, they are going to be playing with a few other bands that I haven't heard of. Vulcan Grady Phillip, uh, Drug, and his Kabong Band. So, I don't know. I'm ready for a night of surf rock music. Turn your reverb up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're super cute. Like, they just look really cute. They always have little matching outfits. And yeah. they do a really badass cover of Toxic by Britney Spears. Oh, and it's sweet. all, like... 
just um, instrumental. There's no lyrics. So yeah, that it's really fun. really fun. Tickets are $20. The doors probably open at 7.30 and the yeah. show starts at 8. Um, remember, it's upstairs. I hear that they're going to be shutting down for a little bit, but uh -huh. these shows are still going to continue until further notice, right? Yeah, yeah. All three? Uh-huh. All three of them because they're doing some uh, renovation. It's going to look awesome. More awesome than it already is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so... Um, but uh, we'll be posting what we know, of course, on our list. Um, <laughs> so, Spence, what is yours? So, at SBC's The Cellar, they're having a Lasso the Moon speakeasy night with 83 Skidoo and the Paper Moons. And I do believe that is happening tonight. Oh, awesome. That is so cool. So, um, have you ever seen any of the bands? I have not. You have to not? be honest, I have yeah. not, and that's rare yeah that is rare <laughs> wow yeah i know I, i've um seen quite a few of them uh, i know I think, let's see joe, let's see it. it's joe dillstrom's in the paper moons yeah i've seen so the paper moons i know i've seen him but it looks like it's going to be a really really fun event um and sbc she showed you my sheet sheet <gasps> oops <laughs> cheat sheet <laughs> my, my sheet sheet <laughs> so I, I heard that um, the seller just rolled out a new menu. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep, they've got tacos now. They have tacos now? On the menu permanently because they did them a few times yeah. just like uh, on a Sunday night they would do like a here's something we're thinking yeah. about and the tacos were definitely something that uh, stuck out. They were like, well, we better add them to the menu. Oh well, man, I need I to go to try, try some them. tacos. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, why is it your favorite bar? Fun bucket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what is the fun bucket? Tell them. It's uh, you get six different beverages in a yeah. bucket with ice, and it's fun. Yeah. And it's in a bucket. <laughs> and it's in the bucket. A yes. fun bucket. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> He's my friend. Okay, so <laughs> my second pick is the fabulous. Freddie Mercury tribute yeah. at the Riff on Friday. It starts at seven o'clock, and um, I am so excited about this because it is the finale. That's the sad thing about it. But Randall Shreve is one of my friends uh, from a long time ago, mm -hmm. and uh, it, he just kind of embodies Freddie Mercury. It is so <laughs> crazy to see. Have you ever seen one of his I past ones? But I've seen him do other stuff and I can I can totally understand yeah. what you're saying. <laughs> yeah, we've been posting some pictures from the last one um, and yeah, it's just crazy the resemblance, but the whole entire production is awesome. Um, there are some of our sponsors, Drummer Boy Infinity, mm. they're our sponsors and they're the ones that put this on and they also do uh, they did Whitney Prince. Houston, they do a Prince. Oh wow. Yeah, and it was we were honored to be able to do it last time they were here. I think it was in February. But this is the finale. Uh, tickets still are on sale, but they will be running out fast because it always gets packed yeah. in there for this show. Mm -hmm. And he only does it yeah. very rarely. Yeah. So Being the finale, <laughs> we're not going to see them again doing this. Aww. Yeah. Probably so. for another year or more. Yeah. More or more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. they're, they're going out towards uh, New York and stuff. Yeah. So wow. it's going to be awesome. Um, at the Riff, Friday, 7 o'clock. We'll be there for sure. Very exciting. Um, but that is just a small portion of everything that is going on in and around Springfield. For our full list of events, do you know where to go? Do you know? On the scene. Yeah. On Facebook. On yeah. Facebook and Instagram and, and our website. <laughs> on the scene 417.com yeah yeah <laughs> now guys um if you want to get a little uh you know boost in your your uh promotion and marketing we do that and we love to do that we want to go and promote you um because it is so much fun and we love doing it because you are working hard we want to work hard for you now to contact us for that karina where Send us a good old email at onthescene417 at gmail.com. 
Yeah, now I want to say a big thanks to all our sponsors. Thank you. And thank you, sponsor. <laughs> thank you, sponsor. Thank you, sponsor. <laughs> so, uh, We're a big sponsor. Thing. Yeah, yes. So, Spence here from Bash in the Grass, <laughs> um, he's one of our sponsors, and that's why he's here today, to, to this, this weekend with us because his thing is going on in just one month. And we just did a video, so you need to go back on our page and look at that. But really quick, when is it? September 9th and 10th at Honey Bluff Shenanigans, Shenanigans Party Venue. And where? Where is that? It's in Marionville. Marionville, okay. So in September 9th through the 10th, and tickets are still on sale. Uh, make sure to check out that video, and it's going to be so much fun. Also a raffle, guys, for this amazing piece of instrument. Handmade By guitar. hand, yes. Yes, it's very, very, very pretty. So you'll have to see it on the video and get that raffle ticket. But can't wait for that. Um, a big thank you for our sponsor, like I was saying just a little bit ago, Freddie, well, <laughs> Drummer Boy Infinity with the fabulous Freddie Mercury tribute. And then we have, of course, our wonderful uh, teammates, Zen Linz, and, oh uh, man, we have, oh, Dancing Sound Man now. Man, there's so many. Okay, so Everyone. you saw them right at the beginning. Until you. next time, guys, <laughs> make sure to stay safe and come join us out on the scene. Mm -hmm.